रेडी स्टार्ट आई थिंक वन ऑफ द रीजन्स वाई दिस शॉर्टफॉल इज टेकिंग प्लेस इज द बिग डिफरेंस एंड गए बिटवीन द सम्स ऑफ मनी फॉर विच वी आर बजटिंग एंड पासिंग इन दिस हाउस एंड इट्स एक्चुअल यूटिलाइजेशन एंड रीचिंग द मासेस हु आर सो ईगर फॉर एम्प्लॉयमेंट एंड हु आर सफरिंग फ्रॉम सो मच पावर्टी ड्यू टू अनएम्प्लॉयमेंट आई एम इन सिंपैथी विद द ऑब्जर्वेशंस मेड बाय द प्रीवियस स्पीकर बिकॉज आई एज वन हु हैज बीन कनेक्टेड विथ वन ऑफ दीज बोर्ड्स आई हैव फील्ड आ लॉट ऑफ डिफिकल्टीज इन एक्सपेडाइटिंग द वर्क एंड स्पेंडिंग द मनी अलॉटेड आई फील दैट द होल ऑर्गनाइजेशन डज रिक्वायर मॉडिफिकेशन सो फार एज द ऑर्गनाइजेशनल आस्पेक्ट इज कंसर्न इट इज नोन दैट द गवर्नमेंट्स मेथड ऑफ डूइंग एनी थिंग is rather slow and tidy the procedure is very difficult and prolonged and here we have to deal not with one particular section of the people or industry fixed at a particular place the whole activity is spread over the villages long distances and families whose condition the non officials are in the best position to know and appreciate here the secretary the deputy secretary or the under secretary is sitting in some office or the deputy minister or minister is sitting somewhere surrounded by secretaries or deputy secretaries he knows their points of views only he is obsessed be certain formalities etc he is not obsessed with the condition of the poor people and their difficulties are not realized so much as the difficulties of the secretariat that is the real problem and that has to be tackled as a matter of fact the question of having a statutory body has been hanging fire for a long time the khadi and village industries boards consists of a very good set of people who are very enthusiastic who are people with missionary zeal they have been doing this work all their life they are on this board but they find themselves handicapped because they cannot function independently they are tied down by so many rules and regulations and all kinds of forms and formalities we must trust these people who have devoted their life to this work their main aim in life has been 
to work for these people it is high time that we be made this body a statutory body i understand that such a demand had been made by them and i hear that even a bill had been drafted for that purpose i would like to know why nothing has been done so far in that direction and why it was ignored the government of india should take immediate action in this matter